hey guys welcome to protocol as point okay so in this tutorial let's learn how to give a borders to a image visits in flutter so i'm making this video tutorial because i got a comment from one of my subscribers saying to make a video tutorial on covering how to give borders to widgets in flutter okay so let's begin so here i have created a demo app just for an example purpose so in this tutorial we are going to cover three types of borders that you can give to your image widget so one is a complete triangle rectangle image and one is a border radius for a image and one is one sided uh, borders to a image okay so let's get started so this is my code that has been running over here okay so i'll just remove the code from here and let's get started freshly from now okay so before starting the coding part let me show you the images that i have added in my project okay so here i have created a assets folder so inside this assets folder i have three images been added so all the three images are jpeg okay so now to access this assets folder i have gave permission in pop specification.yaml file over here okay okay so now let's get started with the coding part and give borders to the images okay so here i am making use of image.assets to show a image in my app so my images are in assets folder so assets image one dot jpg okay so let me hot refresh so you can see i have a image been shown here okay so let me give you a sized box with height as 10 just for spacing purpose okay so like this i will just add all the three images so i'll just copy it and paste it over here okay so refresh so i have added the images over here okay so now let's give borders to these images one by one okay so to give borders to these images so there is no such property direct property to be used in this image assets so what i need to do is i need to just wrap this image so just wrap this image with container widget okay so this is my container okay so for this first image i want to give a complete square or a rectangle uh, borders okay so for this i will just make use of decoration and then box decoration and inside this box decoration we have a property called as borders and the borders i need from all the sides so borders dot all so let me give a width of 5 pixels and a colors to the border so let me give a color as orange let's say orange okay so hot refresh so you can see i have a rectangle borders to my image okay so this was the first example okay so let's come to the second example to give borders to my second image so for this i want rounded circular borders so here i need uh, circular borders okay so for this what i can make use of is uh, second so widget clip rectangle okay so this is the widget that i want to make use of so i can just clip the borders of this images by making use of this okay so let me hot refresh and check what has happened so there is no changes okay so here border radius border radius dot circular 
and here I need to give a circular as some pixels so let me give a circular border of 15 pixels so let me check now so you can see I have a 15 circular border radius to this image okay so now I want a border color means I want to give a color to this border radius for this image so what I can do is the same thing that we have done for the first image that is container and then you use decoration so let's use it again okay so this time I need to wrap my clip rectangle image a widget sorry so container uh, decoration box decoration okay so borders dot all let's give width as 5 pixels for this and the color as color this time I will give as red okay so hot refresh and let's check okay so now you can see I have a rectangle uh, shaped borders to this image okay so I need to give a radius to this uh, uh, container that box decoration okay so here we have the same that is radius dot circular so let's use 20 pixels so you can see I gave a radius for this image also okay so this was the second example okay so now the third example so this time I want to give a border at one side of my image for example left side okay so let's check it out how can I do it so first of all let me wrap this widget with a container widget okay and now the same that is decoration I will make use of and the box decoration okay so inside this box decoration I will make use of border and to the border I will just attach a border widget okay so inside this border widget we have a property to give a image uh, border at one side of the image so you can just make use of left right top and bottom okay so first of all let me give at the bottom of my image so at the bottom I need a border border side okay so width let's give as 20 and color let's give as colors dot blue okay okay so let me hot refresh and check my screen so you can see I have a border at the bottom of my screen with 20 width let's decrease the size let's make it 10 okay okay so like this if you want to give at the left you can just make use of left property hot refresh okay so you can see I have a border at the left of this image okay so let me give a padding to this whole widget let's give padding as 25 okay so you can see okay okay so one more thing I need to tell you so if you give a uh, width and height to this container suppose let me give a width of 200 by 300 and let's check so you can see so it is not completely taking the available space of this container that's because the size of the image is this much only okay so suppose if you want to fill all the corners of this border so inside this image widget we can make use of 
a property that is fit so inside this box fit not fill you can make use of okay so you can see like this okay so i want a right border also border dot side width of 10 and color let me give color as some other color let's check how it look okay so red i will give okay so you can see so you can give different borders on all the sides and top okay so this was just an example so like this you can give a 3d type image view to your image borders okay so that's all for this video tutorial the complete source code of this tutorial will be on my website that is protocodespoint.com so you can just get the link in the description so that's all for this video tutorial thanks for watching please do subscribe protocodespoint thank you